don't have to feel obligated to go to this party. It's just going to be a lot of kids playing silly games. Are there going to be balloon animals? Because I love those. <laughs> uh, no, uh, Jake's a little old for that. Balloon animals are a very underappreciated art form, Alan. <laughs> just give me a minute to get ready. Okay. You know, it's probably going to be... A very, very dull party. I, I wouldn't be going myself if I weren't related to the kid. And without balloon animals, you gotta ask yourself, is it really worth the trip? How do I look? I'm, I'm sorry, I, I think I swallowed my tongue. Thank you. It, it, it's amazing. My, my ex-wife would take hours getting ready, and the end result wouldn't be nearly so... this. <laughs> Give her a few tips at the party. Uh, oh, gee. Uh, she doesn't respond well to tips. Okay. Anything else? Well, even before I say it, I know it sounds insane, but do you think you could put on a few more clothes? Don't I look okay? Oh, yeah, yeah. You, you look terrific. It's just, I wouldn't want people to get the wrong idea. About? Uh, uh, about... Maybe if you just put on a jacket and a hat. Do you have a poncho? Are you ashamed of me? No, no, I, I'm proud of you. In, in fact, I'm so proud that yesterday I, I almost signed up to be a Christian missionary in the Sudan. We don't want your family and friends to see me. Oh, good, you understand. You no, know, Alan, my friends are judgmental, too. Uh, about what? About you. None of them get why I'm with you. Well, uh... At the risk of shining a light on something better left unexamined. Why are you with me? Because you're cute and smart and really, really grateful. All true. And if my friends can't understand that, well then tough tomatoes. Candy, you're a remarkable girl. Thank you. Unfortunately, so am I. You want to have a quickie in the car? Well, all right. But this time, let's pull over first.